Hey everybody, and welcome back to Outlast. Um, okay. Um, that was odd. So yeah, Outlast. It's out there. The naked guys probably are too. See? But now, now, now we have been watching. Yes. His tongue and his liver. Yours. Mine. Is that a ruler or is that a that looks like a knife? Battery. So, uh... How are you guys doing? You guys look like hillbillies. It's fine. I'm just gonna be over here. This doesn't seem like a wise idea at all. Uh, are they gonna be in the window? <laughs> Okay, that's an easy code to remember. <laughs> Look at me, I am swimming in batteries this run through. So, I'm not commentating a whole lot because nothing really is happening other than just kind of me scavenging and naked guys having questionable hair choices. Um, that was definitely an interesting... Uh, Follow the blood, but blood's not leading me through the way I've been going. So I'm gonna assume I'm supposed to still follow the blood. But I don't know where these dudes went to. I need a key card, so I guess I gotta go down the super dark hallway. Presumably the only way to the naked birds went. That's not a fun knowledge at all. No! Oh shit. So big guys killing little guys. That's not good. If he's trying to fix it, he's probably going back the wrong way, I'm just gonna guess. So, odds of something bad happening the second I pick this up, probably pretty good. Um, if it sounds like I'm talking to somebody else, my girlfriend is watching me play, so, yeah. Okay. Shower room. That doesn't sound like that. Scared me more than it probably should have. They're startling, don't look at me. So how did these guys get through? I'm assuming they're going to be in here. So how did they get through here? I 
don't know where these guys are. I don't know where I am. That was really fucking scary. This is definitely the room I wanted to escape. That can't be pleasant for anybody involved. Okay. Wait a second. There was only one of them in that hallway when I jumped out the window. But there were two of them talking, so where was the second one? Do you think he was behind me? Like to keep me from running backwards? That'd be so fucking scary. <clears throat> right. Okay, that took a little bit of time to read because I was questioning my girlfriend theories and stuff. That guy died in a super hardcore way. Okay. I'm actually surprised there's no items like other than that file in here. God, I hope these guys don't didn't follow me. Like, could you imagine walking around the corner? Nope, right there. I mean it's bad enough knowing that they'll show up eventually. I don't like that. Oh wow, I didn't actually expect that door to open. Let's see what's down this way first though, because I have a feeling I'm supposed to go on that. Locked door, got it. Duly noted. Duly noted. Still not very talkative, I'm aware. Um, it's just, you know, it's kind of sometimes a little hard to come up with stuff to say. Um, there are naked guys and they want to kill me. And that's about, you know, the extent of the situation. We've been recording for about eight minutes now and that really hasn't changed up. Coffee. It's like in every single movie where they're like, "What do you, what do you have to drink?" And they're just like, "I'll have a beer." And the, the bartender's like, "Oh, okay, because I've got beer brand beer just sitting here." This probably is a bad idea. Oh, oh, oh no! Oh, oh! Convenient. They say when God smashes a window, he opens a ventilation shaft. He's definitely still down. So the second I drop down, you know he's going to be right behind. I'm assuming I go the way that he came from. Fuck it. This is what they mean by YOLO. Fuck it. Oh. What the fuck? Ah, oh, sick. There's a stop landing, I guess. Uh, 
That was uh, unexpected. Uh. angle. So, my objective is to find an alternate path to the showers, which is where the naked guys were. And that just doesn't seem like a wise decision either. Gotta reload real fast. Alright, I gotta get out because I can't afford to just sit there with the camera burning daylight. So I'm definitely going to have to sneak by. I'm pretty sure I have to go the direction that he's coming from every time. And that's not a fun prospect. This game is kind of finicky with when it lets me sneak and when it doesn't let me sneak. or not. I'm just gonna chill for a second. Don't wait and find out. Because it would be just like this game where he patrols like the bottom floor until I get up onto the top floor and then he starts patrolling the top floor and I don't really make any progress at all. But I saw him. Maybe I'm just saying, nope, he's definitely right there. The question is, is he going the other way now? Because I'm not hearing him clink around too much. Snorts sound really close. This could be a really bad idea.
Oh no, I don't like it whenever the game does that. Bad things happen when the game does that. Well, there's the showers. Oh. That was not a fun game of cat and mouse. I don't even know what that was. Because I instinctive. Oh. Yeah, dude, I kind of know that feel. I kind of know that feel, dude. Do you mind? Really? Um. Okay, I'm really not cool with Daredevil here following me around. Do you mind, Daredevil? I don't know why you even have batteries in your cells. It doesn't make a lot of sense to me. fell into a pile of organs. There's a lot of things that I look like. Silk is not really one of them. Yeah, I'll say. You will need some help, sir. Well, I kind of feel bad for watching that, actually. Congratulations, though, Outlast. You have made a successfully um, unnerving asylum cell block thing. And you have officially made it creepy as balls. Get off of me, Statues! And they say you can't kill any of the enemies in this game. Prove them wrong. What's the experiment? The dead will be born on the living! That's pretty cool. I like games that, uh, make me feel like my character has weight and body. So yeah, don't make all of the jumps. Miss okay. Everybody needs a blood pill, I guess. I'm just gonna take that. I don't even know why you've got it, man. Alright, bonus points. Whoever actually enters this URL and goes to the website and see if it exists, bonus points. Rudolph G. Winrick. Winrick? I don't know. 90 years old? Wow. Care for his cats. Well, the world will miss you, Mr. Cat. Upstairs, down this hallway. Well, I guess that kind of narrows it down, doesn't it? Joy. I saw somebody standing down there. I mean, the good news is, despite that uh, adventure with Mr. Big, I'm still hovering at around 5 battery average. They were pretty nice to give me a couple, so... That's good. Everybody! Everybody! What the fuck? Don't you worry about that. Don't you fucking Where the fuck did that guy come from? I'm 
mother fuck. Okay, I'm ready to stop getting scared now. Really, I... Fuck! This game! Yep, yep, yep. Just gonna... Excuse me here. Don't mind me. I don't know where that one guy who hit me came from. I was just walking and then suddenly, bang, vision is red. I don't even see him over there anymore. Follow the blood, I guess. I'm gonna see if there's any batteries or something lurking around. Bingo. Although I don't really want to get back on track because now I'm afraid the naked guys are gonna show up again because. It seems like they're the recurring villains the naked guy and then the big ass guy. Well, I can hear thunder. That's pretty cool. I'd really like to get out of the building if possible. Thank God. I didn't really want to go this way. For some reason, the passageway with all the blood and symbols about Wallrider is much better. You know what? Actually, I think I'll take the dark bathroom. I immediately regret my decision. Am I outside? Oh no, the outside's right over there. Oh. Bad feelings. Really bad feelings here. No. The game's not. The game's not gonna make me go into the sewers, is it? Ah. Uh, ah, oh, Jesus, why? Jesus, take the camera. Jesus, take the weird things. Jesus. Well, this looks like the worst that I'm ever going to have to do in my entire life. Um... Fuck. I don't want to do this, actually, right now. I don't. Um, and my timer is saying it's been a 24-minute session, and so I'm going to use that as my excuse not to do this right now, and I'm going to do this later. Um... Probably without my girlfriend around, so she doesn't have to see me sob a little bit every time I round a corner. Because I'm, I'm, I know I'm going to. I mean, let's just look. Let's just look down this way. Let's just, yeah, no, nah. of course, of course, there's somebody down here who got smushed by a bunch of rocks. Why wouldn't there be? Look, just tunnels, tunnels everywhere. Just fucking tunnels. Where the fuck did I come from? I'm going to wedge myself right here, and I'm going to use this as a perfect opportunity to hit the save and exit button. If you guys like this episode, um, with the naked guys trying to box me in and kill me, and the big ass guy chasing me through a really dark room, and then mysterious guy hitting me from behind a whole bunch, because apparently I have a really nice backside, um, like, favorite, subscribe, YouTube, stuff, terms. This is what the popular people say, right? I think so. I think I'm going to eventually get the hang out of this, and soon I will be uh, the most annoying person on YouTube. So thanks for watching, everybody, and I hope you have a great day.